gagging. Hold on, hold on. I really gotta like be careful of what I say because friends with this person. And this person is related to this other person. I just, you know, set my shoulder and my ass so happened to, you know, be in the background because <coughs> can't help it. This shit fat, like, you you're gonna see it. Fell into the trap, bitch. And he was like teasing me back and I was like, He's like, so what you trying to do? And I'm like, mind you, I'm a big bitch. He's like, let's go in the game. My titties perfect, they plastic. Yep. I like my money, Jurassic. Green. This pussy pop back, elastic. Oh. You bitches don't want no static. Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. My name is Wesley. If you do not know who I am, if you do know me, welcome back, bitch. Hey, bitch. So today's video is going to be another story time. This story time is about how I had my first little like sneaky link, I guess you could say. This is around the time where like the word sneaky link became like a thing, you know? So like, this was like my, <laughs> This is really my first thinking link and I can't believe it was with this boy. Like, bitch, my standards have really like jumped up levels cause I, mm, bitch, I would never, now I would never. But if y'all watch my old story time, the one how I got my like get back at my ex, that I wouldn't really consider that a sneaky link because it wasn't really sneaky considering what I did. But I'm not gonna, I'm not gonna talk too much about that because a lot of y'all bitches was eating me up and I just, I, I really felt like my my actions were justified and I'm just so confused on how y'all didn't agree with me. <laughs> It's okay. But yeah, so I wouldn't really call that like my first little sneaky link or whatever, but I'll bitch the other one, I'll bitch that. Oh. <laughs> bitch, that was sneaky, bitch. Yeah, if you wanna hear how I had my first sneaky link and like how it went, then just keep watching. Okay, so a little background, a little information. Hold on, let me turn my phone off because I swear every time I get to record it, a bitch wanna text a bitch like, y'all yeah, never wanna text a bitch during the day, don't text me now. <laughs> Hold on. I gotta snap my nigga back. <laughs> well, my niggas, plural, because you know how that goes. We gonna little, we gonna do a little, a little background, a little like, you know, lead, cause y'all know how I do. I like to give you the before, the like lead up, and then actually tell you what happens because we can't just jump into it and not know what what took place. Like, you know, you know, you know, you know. Okay, so, ooh, I gotta wait. Hold on. <laughs> Hold on, I'm gagging. Hold on, hold on. I really gotta like be careful of what I say because me and him are still like cool and the situation is kind of like, we not the situation more so between me and him, but like the situation itself and like who he is, just kind of like, I don't know. I, I don't know. Basically, Wait, how am I gonna tell this? I really can't, I really can't do too much. Like I really gotta be careful. Okay, I'm friends with this person and this person is related to this other person. And basically like we're all like just cool, you know, like I knew I was friends with this one person. So I automatically became, became friends with the relative or whatever. So that's just how that happened. So like I was already, like I already knew of him. I already was like cool with him, you know, it was just chill. Like every time I would go over to this person's house, you know, they were there and it wasn't like any like weird vibes. Like I didn't get any like blurtiness or anything from the relative whenever I was at that, my friend's house. Like I didn't get any of that. Like, like it was just, you know, cool vibes. Like we were all just, you know, cool friends, you know, yeah, yeah, you, you, you know, yeah. Me being me, I, I don't know if it was just like, I don't know what it was, but like the more I was around this person, the more I was like, hold on, this person's lucky. <laughs> this person's lucky fine. What the, <laughs> hold on bitch. I was just, you know, like really attracted to this person. So I was just, you know, not really, I wasn't doing too much. Don't get me wrong. I'm not that type of bitch. I was not doing too much. If I like you, you're gonna know I like you basically is what I'm trying to say. Like, I won't do too much, but you're gonna get like a little something. Yeah, the more I was around this person, I was like, dang, I, I look, he kind of like this person. I don't know how I got him on Snap. I don't know how, but I got him on Snap. And ever since then, we were just like, just snapping. Like we were just cool friends. Like it was still on friend type of level. Like I still wasn't like trying to, you know, 
do anything or get at him or anything like that. It was just like on a little friend level. So one day I was just like chilling and then we were snapping, like we've been snapping like all day. And then randomly like, this is so embarrassing. Okay, I'm about to tell y'all something. And we don't judge over here. This is a judgment free zone, bitch. And if you get to judging, bitch, you can hit the door because we don't do that shit over here. So basically, I remember we were snapping and I was laying down and th the first time I really didn't do it on purpose. Like the first time I did not do it on purpose. I swear on everything on my soul, I did not do it on purpose on my soul. I didn't do it on purpose. So I was just, you know, set my shoulder and my ass so happened to, you know, be in the background because <laughs> Can't help it, this fat like that you're gonna see it. <sighs> what Trina said, I got an ass so big, like the sun, I st on my soul, I do. But anyways, he opened it and then he snapped me back and then he was like, what is that? And I was like, oh, hold on, um, what do you mean? Like, what did I send? Cause bitch, I snap a lot of people. So like, I was, I really did not know what I sent. He was like, oh, never mind. And I was like, hmm, what the? Did you sing, bitch? Like, y'all call her on, so I'm like, oh, it must have been your, your ass when you sent your shoulders. So I'm like, okay, bitch. I'm in there like motherfucking swimwear. So I send the snap again, you know, a little shoulder with the what's the name poking in the back. And he sends a snap of him, just his face. And I'm like, well, damn, maybe he's not really like with me like how I thought he was with me. So I'm like, do we give up or do we keep going? keep going exactly so i kept going bitch so i was just you know i kept sending a little picture or whatever he was just sending his face back or whatever and i was just like damn like he really not with me like that and mind you this is all while he was like out working when he got home he had like fell into the trap bitch and he was like teasing me back and i was like got him we fucking got him <laughs> oh my god like i can't believe i really like bagged him which Fast forward to now, it's like, bitch, okay, yeah, you bagged him, but he's not really someone to be bragging about like how you bag because like, bitch, let's just say my standards now are very, very, very high up there. Any niggas that I've been messing with now, oh, bitch, <laughs> I did my big one. I did my big one. Don't get me wrong, in high school, I did my big one a couple times, but that time, it, it wasn't very, it, was, it wasn't giving big. It wasn't giving big, Lotto. It was giving very much Rainy Ruchi. It was giving ice spice. Like it, 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 it well, it wasn't even giving ice spice because that'd be a compliment for him. And it's just, it's not giving that. It was giving Coil right. It, it was giving Coil right. He had like thumbs in the trap or whatever. And then he started like teasing back. So then I remember he was laying in his, oh, bitch. He was laying in his bed and he had sent a picture of like him in his underwear. And I'm like, oh, we're about to take it there. And yes, I'm down for the ride. Let's take it there. He was like, what you trying to do? And I'm like, I'm down with whatever you trying to do, babes. Like, let's get into it. So we start doing what, you know, grown people, you know, that are like still childish, still do, because I don't even do that now. I'm not even lie to you. I don't sin no more. I, I I just feel like we're grown now. Like now you should like pull up on me and like talk me out my drawers. <laughs> talk me out my panties. Oh my God. Yeah, so we started sending or whatever. And you know, of course I, <laughs> I did my thug thizzle and made him, you know, what's the name? So then after he what's the name, bitch, he was getting bold. He was like, oh, I got to see it in person. And I was like, that person, bitch. So he was like, well, what are you doing tomorrow? I don't even remember what I said. I'm not even gonna lie. I don't remember what I said, but I made it work to where he would come get me the next night. So we were just talking or whatever, like planning it out. And then the next day came, he was at work and I had a feeling. Okay, so if you don't know, like a lot of gays probably go through this or at least I went through this, but like sometimes guys, like after they nut, they like go back straight. Like they, they become gay for a second. And then after that, you know, get their rocks off, they go back straight and they're like, they don't do that. Like they don't wanna like hang out no more. So I'm thinking the next day when I woke up, I was like tapping him and I was just like, like, are you still down to do this? Cause like, I know how you niggas are. So he was like, yeah. And I was like, oh, like for real, like we're still doing this. Like I really gotta like go through with it. Like I really gotta do this, like, like for real. So he was like, yeah, like we're still doing this. Like we're still down. Like I get off work early tonight, then I'm down. Like we can still do it. So bitch, he's at work. He's keeping me updated. We snap it the other day. The night comes and I'm like, damn, I need to prepare. Cause like, what if we actually do it? So I start preparing girl and bitch, he snapped me. He was like, we still on for tonight. And I was like, up to you. 
And he was like, yeah, we still on tonight then. And I was like, okay, bet. Like, bet, bet. So he told me, he was like, whenever he gets off work, he's just gonna go back home, shower, change, get ready and all that. And then he was gonna come get me. He gets off work, goes home, showers, gets ready. And then he comes over to my house and then he picks me up. Bitch, tell me what, I don't know why guys have done this in like the beginning, but like niggas, I, did, I don't really expect niggas to be opening doors for me. And he literally opened the door for me. And I was like, what the fuck? Like, Y'all, y'all know I don't actually got a bestie, right? <laughs> like, cause y'all really are giving me the, you know, the princess treatment and I'm really a king, right? I'm not even a princess. Shit, I was, I was here for it, girl. I was here for it. He opened the door for me, I get in, you know, we driving or whatever. I don't want to say the car, but I want to say the, yeah. I don't want to say the car, but I really want to say the car. Ooh, and if I say the car, it's going to start a scandal and then people going to think it's, it's the other dude. Damn, bitch, should I say the car? Oh, bitch, should you say the car? Bitch, I want to say the car. Bitch, I don't think you should say the car, bitch. Bitch, is you finna say the car? Bitch, I'm gonna say the car. He came to pick me up in a Jeep. He picked me up in a Jeep and we was just, you know, cruising, you know, windows down, you know, just, it was giving. I was living a fantasy and it was just giving. So we driving or whatever and he goes, to Gunnersville. If you don't know, then you probably won't know like the, the like area of where I was. We drive to Gunnersville and then he like, he's like driving in and I'm like, well, what spot is he taking us to? Because like, I've never like done anything over here. Like I don't know where we're going, you know? So he finds like this little spot or whatever and we park and then he's like, so what you trying to do? And I'm like, He's like, let's go in the back. And I'm like, damn. Like in my head, I'm like really thinking. I'm like, damn, I'm really about to like go through this. Damn, I'm getting flashbacks. Damn, that night, bitch. Oh, that night was bitch. I might have to hit him up whenever I go back home, bitch. I don't know why I keep back my head, bitch. You ain't got no sewing. Anyways, we get out. We go in the back. Mind you, I'm a big bitch. I'm not even gonna lie. I'm tall as fuck. Like, I'm big as fuck. So it's his ass, but Boy, you know this ass super fat. But like, bitch, I'm hot, bitch, I'm hot, bitch, I'm hot. Y'all see, I'm like, I'm a big ass bitch. Damn, in my head, I'm thinking, I'm like, ooh, is we gonna be able to even do a lot back here? Because I'm tall as shit. Like, we might not, we not, we might not be able to do much back here. We get in the back, I start, you know, Munching away, you know, doing my thug thizzle. Y'all know, y'all know how I go doing my thug thizzle. So I'm doing my thug thizzle. And then he was like, turn around, bend over. Okay, so a little TMI. I don't like to do that position first because that shit fucking hurts. When I do that position first, I like to do another one because it like eases everything. And then like, and then we can do that position because bitch, if we do that position, oh bitch, you gon' <laughs> So we did that position first and then like, bitch, it, it, it is what it is. And then like, it just transitioned. And then like, I was just doing multiple positions, bitch. I was, bitch, when I tell you, you would have thought the backseat of that Jeep was the actual bed the way we was doing everything. Like, bitch, when I, oh bitch. Bitch, when I tell you another little TMI, bitch, that man folded me like a motherfucking pretzel, bitch. I ain't never been folded like that before. Like before him, oh, bitch, I've never been, 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 shit got me stumbling just thinking about it, right? <laughs> I was just gagged. I was like, oh my God, like my big ass really got folded like a pretzel. I'm talking legs behind my head, bitch. Never in my life, my own ex didn't even take it that far. Like it was giving basics with him, but like this nigga, oh bitch, it was giving gymnastics, bitch. I was learning different tricks and stuff on the pole and it was just giving, it was giving. But yeah, so that was that. I had, you know, made him, you know, <laughs> Windows all foggy, bitch. It was just, bitch. It was just a lot, bitch. It was a lot. So his parents was even calling him, was like asking him when he was coming home. He was lying to him. He was like, oh, I'm out with the boys. Like I'm out so-and-so's house. Meanwhile, his parents know who I am. So it's like, damn, like meanwhile, whole time you with me, but you not really out with the boys. Like you, you with your, oh, see, I almost slipped up and said too much, but yeah. Um, 
he was like in a rush to get home and my lucky was too like it was looking in late like we were doing it for like an hour and usually whenever i link with niggas it be taking like 30 minutes or less because bitch i just be wanting to you know hurry up and get you out of there and then you know get gone but this time it was just like it was just i was just enjoying it and he was enjoying it bitch it was just <laughs> bitch it was just going on and on and on like bitch i'm not even gonna lie if his parents wouldn't have called him while we were doing the do and like asking him like how long he was gonna be out it probably would have been longer but anyway so we get done or whatever he like rolls down the windows to get the fog out or whatever and uh, yeah he like drives me home like we don't we didn't talk about it or anything like it was just like it happened but like it was just like we didn't talk about it like i didn't really care to talk about it he didn't bring it up or anything it was just that but yeah, he drove me home. Oh, ooh, ooh, backtrack, bitch. Let me tell you what happened. While we were driving home, someone had called his phone. But let's backtrack a little bit. While we were, you know, doing what we were doing, someone had called his phone other than his parents. Like, we know his parents called his phone and he had answered for that, but someone else had called his phone and he didn't answer. When we were driving, someone had called his phone. And he had answered and the person that answered was a girl. And she was like, why didn't you answer the phone when I just called you? And then he was like, oh, I was out with, you know, like one of his friend's name and saying that he didn't see his phone ring and then she's like oh well um so and so wants to talk to you talking about like another she has said another girl's name and i'm like am i in some shit? like i don't know what it is but like around that time i just kept on dealing with people who had girlfriends and i did not know on um, on my soul i did not know because if i would have known bitch we would not have done nothing. I would have made you break up with that hoe. And then we could have done something. But whole time, I'm like, damn, am I in something else again? Like, I don't really know to this day. I still don't even really know. Like, I don't think that was his girlfriend. I just think it was like a girl that he was friends with. I think that's all it was. But yeah, I just thought that was weird. I was like, bitch, am I in something else again? Like, <laughs> Catch a break, bitch. Damn, my like, bitch, let me have my shine. Like, can I have someone who's single? Maybe they want to fall in love with me, you know, marry me? maybe so yeah he had drove me home or whatever and then we got home i showered went back in the room i was laying down and then he had snapped me and he was like are you trying to do it again and i was like damn like again and then he was like yeah like let's do it another time and i was like okay well bet so then after that we just like became sneaky links like we did it a lot of times after that like i'm not even gonna lie like he was the only person that i was like hanging out with for like quite some time so yeah that was that but that's about it for this video hope you guys enjoyed if you want to hear more stories make sure you guys hit that subscribe button comment down below some more videos you want to see from me let me know if y'all want to hear the story times about the most recent events because bitch not even gonna lie college life has been pretty fun so far not even gonna lie and it's almost over y'all can y'all believe i'm really about to be done with my first year of college like that is so crazy but yeah thank y'all so much for watching and i'll see you in the next one <laughs>